Who said it was easy work? Who said it was easy work? Who said it was easy? Who said it was easy? Who said it was easy work? Somebody must do it, so I gotta do it. Who said it was easy work? I'm gonna leave this on my page, and I'm gonna leave this on my page forever. I'm never gonna delete this, right? I don't care what you knew me for before. What do you know me for now? What do you see me doing now? The past is the past. It's written history. I can't change the past. I can't go back and alter the shit. It's done. But what do you know me for now? What do you see me doing now? Whatever you see me doing now, you got to take that. You can't keep dwelling on what I used to do back in the past. Yo, 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 what up, YouTube? Welcome to CN Take, man. My name is Jay Sin. Coming back with another one, man. And as y'all can see, I'm coming live from the Rose Garden, man. Take a look at it. Take a look at it, man. We got another beauty. Y'all already know, I got to thank the Most High for waking me up this morning and giving me another opportunity to be great. And I want to send a big shout out to my brother and my ancestors for looking out for your boy while I'm down here, man. I love y'all. Real talk you know what i'm saying but i wanted y'all to see that clip from fat boy man shout out to fat boy you know what i mean doing his thing right now just letting it be known bro like what am i doing now you know what i'm saying you know what are we doing now bro at the same time because man you're gonna have people that try to bring up your past on some slick shit as if you ashamed of that like bro what don't people realize that listen dog you're gonna have motherfuckers try to slick hate like bringing that up going you know take you back or make you feel stupid or ashamed of shit like that like bro that's what got us here right now so you can't bring that up bro and, and 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 no matter how many times you do no matter how many times you try to you know what i mean go down memory lane bro listen i'm not going with you you know you will have a lot of people that want you to go with them bro because they want to try to remind you of who you was, bro. Who I was isn't who I am today. But that helped me get to where we at, to where I'm at. And it helped you get to where you at too. So don't even try to, you know, don't even, don't even, don't even get them the energy that they asking for. Because a lot of times that's what people want. Like, you know, when people just bring up shit to like have a, you know, have a laugh and you with your boys and y'all just chilling and shit like that. But you still will have people that try to bring that shit up in front of people and bring up certain things to remind people. You know what I'm saying? Or make them stop fucking with you just because of where you came from and what you did and what you've been through, bruh. And that's just some hater type shit. Because they mad at the progress that you made. They mad at your level up. They, they mad at your glow up, bruh. So you got to watch out for that. You're going to have people that try to do that. And they're going to constantly, every time you see them, want to bring up the same shit as if it's really worth talking about it like that. You know, you got a lot of people that stuck back there, too, at the same time. And I don't want to be around that energy either, bro, because we got so many things going for us right now. It's like, yo, who want to keep reliving that shit back there? We was young, we was dumb, you know what I'm saying? We was lost, we was in darkness, bro. Listen, I'm past that shit. Why are y'all still living in it? And why are y'all trying to remind me of the shit that I done been through, bro? I know what I've been through, I know my past, because I'm the one that had to live it. You know what I'm saying? I'm the one that had to live through being an alcoholic, had to live through being a drug addict, had to live through some of them relationships that I was in, bruh. I had to live through that. You know what I'm saying? And I had to go through it, dog. Those was my lessons and my blessings. You know what I mean? My failures and all of that shit, bruh. But guess what? We still here. You know what I'm saying? We still here, like I told y'all the other day. These motherfuckers be wanting you to have animosity. They will, They be wanting you to have hate in your heart. They be wanting you out here mad. They be wanting you full of negativity. And on this journey, bro, what people don't realize, bro, especially when you going through a spiritual awakening, bro, we just ain't got it in us. We too happy that we didn't crossed over already. We too happy that we didn't made it through it already. So even enemies and people that didn't hate it, none of that shit matters to us. So what makes you think that we gonna be, just because you bring up my past, 
that that's gonna stumble me, that like that's gonna make me stagnant, like that's gonna stop me, like as if I'ma think about that and then I'ma go back to being anything that I was back there. It's not gonna work. And then a lot of times you will have people, that, like I said, they'll bring it up in front of people because they 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 low key want to inform them. They trying to make people stop fucking with you. You know what I'm saying? And like, bro, that's not going to work. That's not going to work. And anybody that would listen to that or just stop messing with me because of my past, they didn't belong in my life anyways. They wasn't worthy. You know what I'm saying? Because you have, you know, people stupid like that. You know, when you didn't even, you probably didn't even know them back then. You probably ain't even, you know, didn't even know who they was, didn't even know they existed. So anybody that'll be dumb enough to stop fucking with you because of your past, them the ignorant ones. Them the ones that didn't belong around you in the first place, bruh. So you gotta watch out for that shit because sometimes, man, you motherfuckers be having people like this in your circle, bruh. They be in your circle. Like, nigga, you, how many times are y'all gonna talk about the past? How many times you gonna sit there while a motherfucker wanna bring up some of your worst times in front of people when you was just so drunk, when you was out there sloppy, when you was out here hooking up with just any chick, when you was out here doing just the, the just shit that man, you know, just that people do while they growing, you know what I mean? While they living their life and shit like that. It's like, bruh, you know what I mean? What is it? Now, now, if you was to flip that script and bring up a lot of that shit, you know what I'm saying? Then, then it'll be some issues. So don't sit there and allow that shit, bruh. You know what I mean? You either check that shit at the door, respect, respectfully, or you just stop fucking with them, period. Or just stop fucking with them, period, man. Because, some man, you can't change nobody. Some people just stuck in that mode. Some people want to think that they could bring you down with it. Some people just, you know, they, they are who they are, and that's it. So the fact that you keep going around it, bro, listen, dog, you only hurting yourself in that because you could be using that time to continue your elevation, to continue your rise, to continue your glow up. But but instead, every time you hanging around them, guess what? Y'all sitting around, y'all probably drinking and y'all talking about old shit, talking about old shit. So nobody sitting here talking about starting no business. Nobody sitting here talking about ways to elevate. Nobody talking about some of the spiritual things that they've been going through, they, the, the experiences they having right now. You know what I'm saying? It's because you're not around your element. You're not vibing with any of the people that you're around. And you steady going around them. And guess what? It's lowering your vibration, bruh. It's lowering your vibration when you do that. So some of y'all be subjected to this shit and y'all do that to yourselves. So watch who you hanging around, bruh. Because that's the big question. Just like Fatboy said, what are we doing now? What am I doing now, bruh? You know what I'm saying? Because what I'm doing now ain't nothing like what I used to do, bruh. So let's talk about that. Let's discuss that. You know what I mean? This is where I'm at right now. So stay in that element. That's what you do, bruh. You know what I mean? Stick with the times that you in right now. Because you don't need to be reminded of shit that you didn't already live through. You didn't gone through already. You know what I mean? And some motherfuckers be doing that shit and then wonder why they be relapsing, bruh. Because when you do, sometimes, man, when you let your mind go back there or you around people that steady opening up those doors, bringing up that old shit, letting them put that in your head, that make you go back to doing some of those things. So you wonder why you relapsing again, you drinking again, you eating bad again, and all of that shit because you let some of these motherfuckers bring that around and put that back in your head. You know what I'm saying? And that's what happened, bro, because you lower yourself. You take yourself back. You hit that rewind button, and now you doing some of that same shit that you worked hard to get away from. So don't do that. Some people do that shit on purpose. They come around with that same shit, and that's demonic energy. You know what I'm saying? And I say it's demonic energy because it's a type of manipulation that's being used in some of these negative motherfuckers that's out here. You know what I mean? It's not by accident, bruh. You know what I mean? And you keep biting the cheese. You keep taking the cheese. You keep taking the bait and you fall right back into it. So don't do that, dog. You know, you don't work too hard, bruh. We didn't have to go through too much to change our ways, to change our mindset. To change the way we think, to change our surroundings, bruh. Because we trying to do bigger and better things with our life, bruh. 
You know what I'm saying? Now we got the most high with us, bruh. We getting closer to him, man. Listen, dog, we do not got time to be letting no demonic energy, no manipulation shit take us back like that, bruh. So I just want to share this message with y'all, man. Because listen, dog, some of y'all probably think that it's minor, it's small, but you will be surprised how many people still allow this type of energy around them. And then they wonder why they can't go nowhere. They wonder why they keep resorting back to their old ways. You know what I'm saying? And this could be the key that could just unlock that shit. And then you will know, like, okay, I got to stop doing that. I got to stay away from that person. I got to stop thinking this way. You know what I'm saying? And then the next thing you know, you climbing back up. You back, you back on track again. So remember that, moving forward, all right? Listen, don't let your past hold you back. Don't let nobody keep bringing that shit up around you because they trying to take you back. And that's my word, man. My name is Jason and Sente. I'll let y'all later, man. Peace. I got that more better blues, I wanna do better. Yes. I got that more better blues, I wanna do better. Uh -huh. I got that more better blues, I wanna do better. Right. My aim set for the sky, so I wrote two letters.